I designed this moment, my personal life, my business life, my sex life, the health of my body, the health of my bank account, what I have or don't have, such is life. Coming to you from Los Angeles, California. Summer of coronavirus in September. I don't know if that's fall. Um, my, my mind, uh, my mind lately has been on Joe Biden and Pelosi status all over the fucking place. Uh, definitely don't belong in the White House. I'll admit that. You know, but, but seeing the, just the, the character of people and their acts of not giving a fuck, being stressed out, screaming, getting angry, panicking, um, arguing, I saw this one dude recently. I told this other dude, hey man, put your face mask on. I don't want to get sick. He's like, I'm not sick. You're not going to get sick. Well, I'm not going to get sick. And the dude that started it, you know, he's not reading the other guy's body language of, you know, back the fuck up before I fucking knock you the fuck out. Victim blaming, it's not my fault, it's his fault, it's her fault. Life's unfair. Um, it's it's interesting now. Because I just see, uh, see it all over the place. I went on a dog walk recently. I think the one last night was probably... Um, I kept my bearing because <laughs> I see one fool um, letting his dog take a shit on the sidewalk. Doesn't pick it up. And not just like on the grass or the dirt or on the edge edge of the sidewalk, but the, on the part where people walk. Uh, the most common footpath on there. Yeah, but right before this, I'm walking and seeing uh, people who um, once started me with a gun. Yeah, pull up your gun, motherfucker. Um, you know, just uh, go get your gun, I'll be here. Uh, seen a coward, uh, two face, two face somebody else. Yeah, you know, I'm very proud. Thank God, and selfish bastard that. Uh, We'll walk away from someone uh, from a car accident. It's happened more than once. They've seen them. Well, that's not my problem. You know, my kids are okay. There you go. Like the same. Uh, all, all sorts of people on this dog walk. Another calculation, this, this, this could be a, a video by itself where, you know, I realized I'm, I'm poor and living amongst the poor. Um, because I'm thinking, you know, even with the, the guy leading his shit right there, on the sidewalk. Um, you know, uh, whenever I'm on a dog walk, but even more at night, I, I watch where I step because the muscles like that because they exist. Uh, you know, there's certain streets that I cross 
that when I cross them, I do sprint because I've just seen many accidents. Small streets, big streets. And, uh, is it the condition of life or is it simply just saying, um, let, let me put on my seatbelt because this or that could happen. thinking about the, the next step what to do would be um, best for me so it's always uh, what's the best for me Yeah, on my path of life, I just see uh, just just different people not hold themselves accountable for for this moment, and uh, it's just disturbing because. Again, as Dan Penny would say, uh, you know, it's, it's the simple tacit approval that just keeps on uh, keeps on spawning uh, such behavior. And there's a uh, not a conflict of interest, is it? Conflict of interest, no. Integrity check. Scale. Win some, lose some. So I saw that um, that dude with his dog shitting, <laughs> shitting on the street. I'm thinking, I'm not gonna let my dog loose. He'll probably, uh, he'll probably kill both. The dog and the owner. Then I had to think. Because yeah, I think, you know, what if uh, someone, someone that I care for walks down that sidewalk and slips on shit, slips on it, then slips on it, slips on it, slips on it, then cracks her skull. Steps on it, slips on it, cracks her skull, falls on their own dog and hurts their dog too. You know, but I can't uh, can't do that now. Oh, assholes have a right to be an asshole. And I guess there's a sequence to that, right? Call the cops or <laughs> there's um, a few weeks back. Two and a half, I believe. It was reported that uh, a drunk driver, a black drunk driver in Los Angeles was in the view of the police. <sighs> and uh, he wasn't pulled over or arrested because the cops were too concerned about pulling out, uh, pulling him out because he was black. 
and just have another George Floyd incident. George, George Floyd incident. You know, we're, we're at a time right now where there are mayors, governors, and other politicians that speak about um, defunding the police. Defunding the police. I've seen some people who have food in their belly or a few bucks in their, a few bucks in their pocket. And just seen and seen more uh, again tacit approval, okay, whatever, not caring. And when I mentioned that the uh, threat of uh, these communists on television that say, "Yo, you know, just put on your face mask and hide under your bed." Wait till uh, Biden gets elected. He'll he'll find something to do. Stay home unless you're protesting the evil white police officer. Stay home. Think, I find it incredible that, that well that people buy it. I'm not the smartest polar bear. I forget what sort of behavior I saw the other day uh, in public where someone had a mask, two face, two face mask, gloves, and then a riot gear visor with a plastic visor over the face, and they start to, and then they start drinking water in public, like two feet away from somebody else.
You know, some people are just uh, going on with business, man. They're um, just up operating smaller on the sidewalk uh, or in private or through car delivery or through parking lot pickup. But you know what, uh, so many jobs being lost, especially small businesses being hurt. Again, I believe uh, Yelp has said that uh, over 14,000 restaurants in America are permanently, permanently closed. I forget how many thousands of um, restaurants are also permanently, permanently closed. People uprising in Belarus. I guess I think it's a neighbor of Russia or close by. A few protests, I believe, in the Netherlands. Um, so much shit going on, man. And to me, I, you know. I, I guess I could just um, highlight the stories, cry about them, you know, talk shit and panic, or um, could simply uh, focus on the, the antidote, the cure, which is capitalism, being industrious, making a buck, having a, a, a big piggy bank. No, money's not going to solve everything, but it helps. It helps. I forget what, uh, what videos that came, came across my YouTube list, YouTube recommended. Some have been deleted. It's amazing how much of David Icke London, and London Real has been deleted or banned. What truth, or better yet, what version of truth is allowed out there? But I'll do what I believe it will be uh, the most effective thing to, most effective road, which is simply to go forward, make it happen. 
vote Trump 2020. Remember that there are no easy days, simply days where potential is not fulfilled.